Our time in Angers included seeing the Apocalypse Tapestry, which I talked about in the last episode. But it also included going to see the Jean Lersat Museum, where we saw his Song of the World, which was a response to the um, Apocalypse Tapestry. And both of those events were, or works are just monumental um, pieces of tapestry that were pretty amazing to see in the same town. This cycle of tapestries was started in 1957 and finished about 10 years later, actually just after Lursat uh, died in 1966. It starts with some pretty powerful imagery about the atomic bomb, but it ends with some more hopeful um, imagery about um, nature and the cosmos. And after all that masculine struggle of the Jean Lersat uh, Song of the World, uh, I found this one Dolmerbeer piece in the museum and I was enchanted. It was so much fun. Later in the tour, we went to see the Dolmerbeer Museum and I saw many more of these, but this particular piece was a good end to the day of looking at the Lersat tapestries. We're leaving Angers this morning. This is the hotel behind me. It's too bad because it's been a really great place to stay. I've really enjoyed um, this town a lot. And we're headed south to Albi, which is in the south of France. Not all the way in the south of France. It's a tiny town. We're going to be seeing a couple different tapestries from there. Angers, of course, is full of these kinds of details everywhere you look.